Welcome to the SICK App Studio tutorial. Today we are going to explain how to get started using App Studio and outline its tools and features. SICK App Studio is the software development environment for all programmable SICK apps based devices, including sensing technologies for 2D vision, 3D vision, 2D and 3D LiDAR sensors, and RFID. The development software license is included as part of the annual membership in SICK App Space Developers Club. To use SICK App Studio, you need to have basic programming skills and domain knowledge for the selected sensing technology. To use the software, you need a valid license, which you can order online or request a 90-day free trial at appspace.registration at sick.com. Before we get started using the software, we will first do an overview of the available features. The App Explorer tab shows all of the apps that are loaded in the connected device. It also allows apps to be added and removed. The application software can be freely designed by one or multiple apps. By right-clicking on a file in the App Explorer, the corresponding editor opens. For example, a Lua script editor, a graphical flow editor, or a Web Operator Interfaces Editor. The Monitor tabs are used for monitoring results and resources, to control the emulator during offline programming, and to record and play back acquired data. The Device Page tab contains a viewer to visualize acquired data and graphics, or an operator web interface if available. The App Monitor tab provides information about the performance, such as memory usage, CPU and network load, and file system usage. The console tabs on the bottom are used to print debug messages and to browse variable values and data files created by the running app. The toolbar on top gives you easy access to the most important tools in App Studio. For example, to create a new app, import an app, start the debugger, and run and stop all apps. Finally, when it is time to distribute the developed app, the Package Builder button generates the final software file package. So, how do you use the software? First, click the button Open Connection to see a list of connected devices on the network. Alternatively, you can also start an emulator to work offline. A good way to get started is to look at a sample app. App Studio comes with a large number of sample apps, which can be imported into the App Explorer. Once the app is imported, click the Run All Apps button to see the results. If you want to understand the details of the sample app, the debugger helps you to go through the code and execute the function step by step. You can also set breakpoints to run sections of the code and stop at predefined rows. When the application software is developed and packaged, the deployment can be done by field personnel using the separate SICK App Manager software. You now have an overview of SICK App Studio and you know how to get started using sample apps. Thanks for watching this video.